Let's evaluate this indefinite integral. Well, the first thing we can do that will make this integral easier is we can use the trig identity that tangent squared x is equal to secant squared x minus 1. Now we can separate this into two separate integrals. Now this integral will be much easier to do integration by parts than the original integral. So we're evaluating this integral with integration by parts. We'll say that u is equal to x and dv is equal to secant squared x dx. Therefore, du is equal to dx and v is equal to tangent x. So this integral is equal to u times v minus the integral of v du. Checking the trig integral tables, we see that the integral of tangent x dx is natural log of the absolute value of secant x. Okay, and this integral is equal to 1 half x squared. Therefore, bringing these two together, the final integral is, that's capital F of x, so we just need to add plus c.